Your parents want you to study something you don't like. Yes. Well, then you can use you can use that as a as a pain to push yourself forward. You know, you can you can make a deal with your parents to say, okay, if I don't get into my university this year, I'll apply to your university next year, and then you're forced to work your fucking ass off, right? <laughs> I mean, that that that's the way I would view it because. I'm the I'm the kind of person that if there's two teams playing in the final match, I will put money on the team that I don't want to win. Because then I win either way. If the team I really want to win wins, I, I win and if they, they, they lose I get the money. The win win. You can't lose. I d I, I don't do that, but that's how I would do it if I why lose? Why lose? You don't need to lose. You don't need to lose ever. It's just perspective. So, I would give myself every motivation possible to uh, to be successful. I, I would make I would make that deal, and then then you know where you're going, and you know what you're doing, right? That there's only one. It's like it's like okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna go and get into my university this year, and if something goes wrong and it doesn't work, and you're all right, then next year. I I will do your I'll follow your plan. So um, and and then I work to make sure that I that that my dreams came true, and 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 not theirs. I would use, I would channel their energy to make my dreams become realities, rather than fight against the energy. Rather than have that energy pulling me in a different direction. I can have that energy pushing me in the direction that I want. You know, there's just you have to look at what your parents doing parents are doing or saying and, and realize that there's a lot of energy there. Now how do I take that energy and use that energy to help me? Rather than something that makes me feel tired and um that, that just something that's generally not positive. Well, we take it and turn it around. You're actually fighting with yourself. Because the problem is not really with what your parents want. The problem is what, with what you don't want. I would do what I said. You know, I'd, I'd make a deal with the parents about the, the second year. And say, okay, if the first year doesn't go the way I want it to do it, the, the way I want it, then the second year will be all yours. I would use that as motivation to to get everything that I wanted uh, that I wanted done done and then I'd hopefully not not fight with my parents and then at uh, your stage at your age a year doesn't matter right it's always better if you get what you want and you need and things go forward of course naturally but if you have to wait a year to go and do something, it doesn't matter. Y- yes, you need that sense of urgency to get things done, but it's like it's also it's not like the world's going to end, <laughs> right? Say to your parents, "Look, the world's not going to end if I don't do it this year." And there's another opportunity to do it next year. If there's an opportunity to do it next year, then then I'll go down that road. Look, one of one of the one of the great tactics in negotiation is you never say no you just move things to a later date this is one of the tactics of negotiation with people you you never say no I don't want that you'll say we'll take that idea and we'll timetable that idea or we'll schedule that idea for the next meeting because it's not where we're at right now. You say, that's a good idea. I'm not sure about that. I need time to think about it. Let me try to go down my own path this year. And if I don't get where I want to get, then obviously I'm going to have to go down your road next year. So I'm not I'm not saying no to it. I'm not rejecting it. I'm, I'm embracing it as a really open alternative to what I want to do if what I want to do doesn't work out. And one year down the road, I'll be 
hopefully much wiser about everything as well. So I'm not going to lose that. And just just keep that keep keep that keep that door open. Keep that keep that opportunity there. Things you you you're in a situation where things don't have to be right now. You can you can you can you can afford to you know be flexible with the time and play with it a little bit in terms of long-term career goals and uh, universities and college courses and things and a lot of people when they're at university and studying they stop for a year and take a year out just to get a fresh perspective on things <laughs> there's, there's no rush to get into the rat race of the working world okay right the, 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 you know, you don't want to rush into a stressful job and you know being a good little soldier and following everybody's orders and you use what you can to your advantage if it's possible um channel the energy in directions that 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 help you get to where you need to go